It's just for one night. They said you're going home tomorrow. They also said I'd have my own room. He better not be contagious. He's not. Are you sure? Should we ask his doctor? You just asked me and I said no. But you're not a doctor. Your career stalled at nurse. Okay, listen. I done put up with your nonsense long enough and it ends now. That boy is your roommate? That's the situation and you gonna make the best of it. You get my drift? So Sheldon comes home tomorrow? Yep. Everybody's thinking it, so I'm gonna say it. This has been a nice break. Hey, don't talk about your brother like that. Since when are you on his side? Since Dad almost let him die. Unbelievable. It's either cartoons or men in their underwear banging their heads together. You complain a lot. Excuse me? Seriously, dude, you need to relax. How can I relax? I'm being held captive in a bacterial playground. Why are you here? I had to have my gallbladder removed. Why are you here? I'm having surgery tomorrow. How come? I was born with a hole in my heart. My mom says everyone was born with a Jesus-shaped hole in their heart, but I'm guessing this is different. Yeah, they're going to put a patch on it. And then it just stays there forever? Yeah. Like a Band-Aid you never have to pull off. That's great, because that's the worst thing about Band-Aids. They may have removed my gallbladder, but not my wicked sense of humor. What you working on? A welcome home sign for Sheldon. Well, that's a nice thing. Yeah, but this W took me half an hour. You want some help? Yeah. Georgie, get your ass in here! How did you find out you have a hole in your heart? I fainted playing soccer. Mm, I guess I'm fortunate. Why? I don't and never will play soccer. How did you know something was wrong with your gallbladder? It started as a minor tummy ache, then escalated to a major tummy ache. Luckily, I handle pain well. What are you gonna do when you get home? Enjoy a bathroom I can relax in. Although I do like that there's a big red emergency button in there. I actually don't mind it here. What about the food? It's not as good as my grandma's tamales, but nothing is. How long has she been taking care of you? My whole life. She'd be here, but she's watching my brother. My Mimo takes care of us sometimes, too. I'm excited for my heart to be fixed, because then she won't have to worry about me anymore. But hey, once they put the patch on my heart, I swore to be like Iron Man. Technically, Iron Man has a magnet, not a patch. And technically, I said sort of. Touche. Where'd he go? Where's Ricky? He's in surgery. Oh. But look what I'm doing. I'm packing up so we can go home. Can we wait until he's done? I think it's gonna be a while, honey. But why don't we get a move on and then we can check on him later? Okay. One second. Excuse me, Nurse Robinson? Yes? Yeah. Will you give this Iron Man comic to Ricky? I'll see that he gets it. Thank you. Mm-hmm. And thank you for taking care of me. You're welcome. You stay healthy. I will. When did he become nice? Uh, I'll get the next one.